that I do on a revision morning is open my blinds so I can get some light into my room so that I feel productive. So Pearsons have sent me these maths revision cards and this business revision guide and these have both helped me so much this week with my exams. Let's actually talk exams. Another top tip, try and revise when your little brother's out. Remember to dance and have fun whilst you're revising. Week. Hey guys, it's Rosie and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I am doing my exam revision preparation for my GCSE mocks and everything else that I do in the day. Plus, I teamed up with Pearsons for the best revision and exam practice that you guys can get. Pearsons are the world's leading learning company. So stay tuned for that. So guys, before we get on with this video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click that notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos just like this one. And stay tuned all the way to the end because I'm going to be giving you guys my top tips on revision and exam prep. And I would actually know because I'm in my exams right now. So guys, the first thing that I do on a revision morning is open my blinds so I can get some light into my room so that I feel productive and that's what I'm going to do. And then I turn on my light as well. And now I need to make my bed because obviously I am going to be up here because I am revising. So I need to make my bed all cosy. So when you're revising, I feel like it's really important to actually feel and be comfortable. So when I'm revising, I can't be too hot and I can't be too cold. Otherwise, nothing just sits in my head properly. So if it's a hot day, then obviously I want to wear something more cool. So maybe a pair of shorts or a crop top with some jeans. Um, and then if it's a really, really cold day, then I'd obviously wear some like sweats with a jumper because I really want to feel warm and I just can't revise without being comfortable and I don't think you guys can either so that is my first tip make sure you are comfortable in what you're wearing you're not too hot and you're not too cold so let's find an outfit okay guys this is my outfit that I'm wearing it is actually quite a hot day today so I'm wearing this um but I need to get ready, as in I need to do my hair and my makeup, and I'm also going down to the office later to do some revision. You guys might have seen it, you might have not, I'm not sure, but we're gonna go down there anyways. Okay, I have now washed my face, it's all fresh and clean. So I'm going to do a bit of light makeup, but I am revising, so it's just gonna be light makeup. But I still want to look good, because I'm probably going to do some TikToks and Instagram stories and stuff like that. But my face feels very smooth.
I'm downstairs in my office now guys and as I said I've teamed up with Pearson's for this video. So Pearson's have sent me these maths revision cards and this business revision guide and these have both helped me so much this week with my exams. Pearson's is actually the world's leading learning company and we actually use Pearson's products at school which help us so much. So these are the revision cards here and there are actually a hundred cards in here and it comes with three dividers and these have helped me so much to actually learn what is on the cards. So we have the cards, we have a easy guide of how to use them, we have the three dividers and then the box. So this here, these are the dividers. So you've got one that says had a look, one that says nearly there and then one that says nailed it. So once you have looked at a card, if you got it all right, you can put it in nailed it. If you were partially there, you can put it in nearly there. And then if you just didn't get it, you put it in had a look. And then you can go back to these and be like, oh, I need to practice had a look and stuff like that. First card guys, I'm just gonna go from the top down. So this says solving angle problems and it has the angle here and then it has got kind of like a multiple choice questions. Right, let's check the answer. So I got 70 and it is C, 70. So I got the right one. So let's put that under nailed it. Let's do another one. This is so good because if you don't actually get it, it shows you how to work it out on the card so then you understand. So I'm gonna put this one in had a look. So that is basically how you use the cards. These cards are so helpful and have helped me so much with my exams. And now I'm going to work on this book, which is business. And it is basically, it gives you little practice questions in it, little bits to do, and it's got the same at the top. So like had a look, nearly there, and nailed it. So you can tick it off once you've done it. This is definitely the best revision and exam practice that you guys are going to get. So be sure to get yours. The link is in the description. And to be honest, I don't think I would have got through my exams without this. Thanks Pearson's for sending me this. Also guys, be sure to check out Pearson's online revision tools because Pearson's have actually been around for 170 years. So if anyone knows anything about revision, I'm pretty sure it's Pearson's. I'm starving, let's go and get a snack. My next tip is to make sure you are not hungry, make sure you've got loads of water in your system and you're having a healthy snack. You don't want anything like chocolate or sweets because that will just give you a sugar rush and then you'll just drop down. Like, it's not good. So you need something healthy that will keep you going and it's good food for your brain. Noodles. Love noodles. Let's actually talk exams. So I took history, I took drama, I took business and textiles. And then I took the core subjects, maths, English and science, which I have to do. Um, and they obviously aren't the funnest, except from when I actually know what I'm doing. So in maths, now because of the revision cards, I actually know what I'm doing and it's helped me a lot in my tests. And this week has actually been my mocks, which are they're the practice exam for my big GCSE exams before I leave to go to like college or university. So I'm getting a good practice and I need to get a good grade for it because then it can tell me what I'm actually going to get in my real exam. So I need to revise a lot. My highest prediction would be a high B in English and drama. And my lowest prediction would be a, probably like a low C in science, because I don't like science and I'm not good at it. But everything else I'm passing on, so it's fine. And this week, the week that I'm starting my exams, I have just released my seventh single, Sophie in Your Love, which is out now, so go check it out. I've had such a busy week. The link will be at the end of this video. My other top tip is fresh air. You need fresh air. So if it's a lovely day, go outside, maybe do your revision outside. And if it's raining, literally just stand on your doorstep and just get some fresh air because it helps with everything. Helps having a break. I'm gonna do some TikToks out here now. I'm back upstairs now guys for the second part of my revision. Another top tip is to put your phone or any devices in a special place where you can't like reach it or find it. I put mine on my stairs because I just leave it there and have an hour just without your phone to do revision. You might need 
your phone for revision but if you don't guys try and give yourself an hour without your phone because if you're on call to your mates if you're texting your friends you're just not going to get anything done so just just you right there mate <laughs> another top tip try and revise when your little brother's out <laughs> What are you doing? I am now back in my room just to change up the environment so I can do my revision up here. Another thing, change your environment because otherwise it gets too boring. And what I like to do because I'm into music is actually listen to music, obviously, because it actually relaxes me a lot. So, hey Siri, play Safe In Your Love by Rosie McClelland. Here's Safe In Your Love by Rosie McClelland. <laughs> Right guys, my feet, they are freezing cold and my feet do normally get cold. So I need to put some socks on, some fluffy socks. And what I really like to do is I like to get socks that don't match my outfit, especially when I'm revising, because it doesn't really matter about the looks. It matters about how warm you are. Just look at my flowers. This is from my song release last night. My mum actually got me these as a gift because I love flowers and I've never actually been brought any. And this is my first bunch of flowers that I've been brought. And my nan was telling me all last night what they were. Right, let's get some socks, guys. This is my sock collection, by the way, if you wanted to know what it looked like. Um, this, actually, it does go a bit. It still has a tag on brought them the other day these are new these are like knee-high socks but they're really really comfy so remember to dance and have fun whilst you're revising because it's all about having fun when you're doing it. If you don't have fun, then nothing's just gonna go in. So I like to have a joke or like make songs up with flashcards. So like trigonometry, whoa, whoa, angles, whoa. <laughs> So guys, that is the end of my exam and revision preparation. And I really hope you guys like this and this video actually helped you because I really hope it did. And good luck with your exams if you're doing them. Once again, I want to say a big thank you to Pearsons for partnering with me in this video and helping me with my revision and exam prep and practice. And don't forget to get your Pearsons revision products. All the links are down below. They really help me, so I'm pretty sure they'll help you. And also guys, there's a link that you can click right here right now so guys that is the end of this video and i really hope you guys liked it if you did please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and click that notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos just like this one and also please go check out my song because i'm so proud of it and i really want you guys to hear it and comment on if you like it or not love you all go check out my new song and i'll see you next time bye The link will be next, so stay for the end card. Oh, and by the way, check out some of my other videos here. And like I said, subscribe to my channel. Don't forget my new song, Safe In Your Love, is out now everywhere. Click the bottom left square to listen to it.